Moving up to the gate, it's Honey Levac with Natasha Hall and Norway But My Way. Then Curitiba, Cameron Hall, Doyen and Emotional Rescue. From the outside, Windy Lane, Hanover, Mountain View Girl and Universal Victory. It's second race post time from Woodbine. The second race swings into the stretch. This the second 2001 elimination. Breeders Crown two-year-old trotting fillies. They're off and trotting, and it's a clean start for all with Curitiba following the gate away. Cameron Hall is out well to be second. Down the center came Doyen. Natasha Hall follows off the leaders into the top four. Emotional Rescue driving outside from fifth. Norway, but my way, is put in line from six. Honey Levac followed through in seventh. And laying off the leaders is Windy Lane Hanover. She's left in eighth position as post-time favorite out of Mountain View Girl. And Universal Victory was a tenth and last away. Crossing over to make front was Cameron Hall for LaChance ahead of Curitiba. Still caught to the outside, Doyen, 27-3. and three. They round the first turn, and they're into a very rare east wind this night, and the leader by two is Cameron Hall. Curitiba trots along in second. Doyen going a long, long journey on the outside third. Natasha Hall closing up the hole in fourth. Emotional Rescue on cover is fifth at the outside. Norway, but my way, goes to the outer flow from six. Honey Levac seventh in on the pylons. Windy Lane Hanover is fourth over, way back in eighth at the stage. Age, then Universal Victory and Mountain View Girl 10th on the outside. 58 seconds was the half and going strong is Cameron Hall. Curitiba trots along in second. Three wide now for Emotional Rescue. We'll let wheels that one up to gain the top trio and Natasha Hall trots in from fourth. Doyen showing the strain of the parked out trip from fifth. Norway, but my way is three high from sixth out around to Honey Levesque and it's back to Universal Victory. Windy Lane Hanover and trailing a Mountain View Girl. They turn for home Home off three quarters of 128 flat. Nobody close to reaching Cameron Hall. Emotional rescue. Looming boulder on the outside. They're in the stretch. In the second 2001 Breeders Crown Elimination. Two-year-old trotting fillies. Cameron Hall is going strong. Uh, and LaChance is looking extremely confident for good reason on this one. She's moving off on the field. That's Cameron Hall. A big display to win the second. Elimination. Emotional rescue was second. Windy Lane Hanover closing third. Curitiba looked to be fourth. Universal fict victory was fifth. Norway, but my way, sixth. And Cameron Hall trounced him in 157. Five Cameron Hall, the second race winner of the second 2001 Breeders' Crown Elimination. Garland Lobel, two-year-old Bay Philly from Ken Angus. Owned by Walnut Hall Limited of Lexington, Kentucky. Trained by Robert Stewart. Driven to victory by Mike Lachance. That's her third win in four starts this year and a race record 157. Cameron Hall in the second Breeders' Crown Elimination.